Why not test the soil? Why is the city afraid of it? I happen to know that uh, of the Tucker Street site. I know that for more than 40 years, there was an uh, oil company that stored its vehicles on that site. The site is soaked with petroleum. And I'm certain many of you, I certainly I know that uh, Mr. Clark is aware, that Grimes Oil was situated there. And it's a hazardous waste site, not just with lead paint. So how can I, as a longest serving member of the Boston City Council, countenance this process which has a blind eye to some possible serious environmental hazards? And how can I accept the idea that simply by putting some plastic or the geotech fabric over that site, that it's going to be clean and safe? I say, test the soil, claim the site before voting on the overlay district. To do otherwise, with all due respect to all of my constituents who I love and respect, and who return me to office for a 15th time for some reason, I haven't figured out why yet, but I'm not asking that question. My question is, why does the city refuse to test the site, the soil at both of these sites? 